Today we'll be making a pirate bomb. These are things you'll need. A styrofoam ball, rope, cardboard, hot glue, box cutter, black acrylic paint, and a paintbrush. First I started out by sanding the styrofoam ball, mostly just to get rid of the um, seam it had in the middle. Uh, there were some other parts that I sanded down just so it's smoother. Then I made the little cylinder piece that goes on top. I first uh, cut out a uh, circle out of cardboard, and I cut another circle in that uh, where the rope would go. Uh, and then I cut out the sides of the cylinder out of some cereal box cardboard. And I glued it together with hot glue. Then I glued the cylinder piece on top of the uh, styrofoam ball. Then I painted the whole thing black with black acrylic paint. Uh, I did have to uh, do a couple coats just uh, to make sure none of the white of the styrofoam was uh, showing through. Also just a tip uh, for gluing anything to styrofoam with hot glue. Um, is let the hot glue uh, cool down just a little bit um, before you uh, use it on styrofoam or also to like melt through the styrofoam and ruin your prop. So this is just the second coat uh, getting just covering all those little white spots that I missed first time around. You can also use spray paint to uh, paint this, but be careful with spray paint and um, styrofoam. Uh, you want to like seal in the styrofoam either with uh, a few good layers of watered down white glue or Mod Podge uh, because spray paint will eat through styrofoam. Then I covered it in a layer of Mod Podge. Uh, Mostly just to seal everything in and give it a semi-glossy uh, finish. I only did uh, one coat of Mod Podge, but if you want it to be more protected, then do a couple more. And then I uh, cut off a piece of rope as the fuse. Um, and I did give it a light brown wash, but you can't really tell. Uh, so yeah, that's how you make a pirate grenade bomb thing, and I'll see you guys next time.